This is a quick tutorial on net present value for uneven cash flows with the Hewlett Packard 12C calculator. First we turn it on, make sure that we have a clear registry. I'm going to start out with a cash flow of zero at the beginning. So I hit zero, then I do the G, CF zero, then we go to cash flow of 10, cash flow of 20 in the next year, 30, 40, and then 50. <clears throat> now if we are going to add the uh, IRR, the, uh, the needed uh, If we're going to do the uh, required rate of return of 12%, we just type in a 12 and then hit I. Now, make sure that you don't already divide by 100 to give it 0.12. When you hit I, it takes care of that for you. Now, all we have to do is hit the F key, and then uh, you'll see right under PV, or right above PV is the NPV. That gives us a net present value of 100. If we were to change this so that we had an initial investment of $100, so we'll clear out the reg registry, 100, change sign, G, and then CF0, and then we did the, the same thing, uh, the same five years of uneven cash flows, where the first one is 10, say that is CFJ, 20, CFJ, 30, CFJ, 40, CFJ, 50. Then we're going to say the same IRR, which is 12, and then do net present value. We still actually end up with a net positive uh, present value. So in that case, we should undertake the project. If we want to uh, now change the uh, required rate of return to say 6%. All we have to do is type 6, store that in the I registry, do the function net present value, and all of a sudden we have a much greater net present value. That's because it's being discounted by a less percentage. And that's it.